Welcome back. Our News for Tucson Anchored in Tradition series continues this week. Today, News for Tucson's Destiny Quinn shares how to make Christmas Oreo balls. Hey everybody, I'm Destiny Quinn and I'm going to show you how to make Christmas Oreo balls. If you're like me and you're not much of a chef, then this is a super easy recipe. Anybody can make it and it doesn't take a lot of ingredients. You just need family size Oreos, some chocolate melt, almond bark, and then cream cheese and sprinkles and some icing. Or if you can find colored candy melt in red or green, then that works as well. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take all the Oreos and you're gonna put them all in the blender. So now you'll see it's all just cookie crumbs, so that step's complete. You're gonna take your cream cheese and we're gonna start melting it. So now you're gonna combine your two ingredients, the Oreos and the cream cheese. And you're going to start mixing it. You're gonna fill up your cookie scooper. You take it, roll it into a ball and place it on your parchment paper. You're gonna put it in the fridge and let it chill there for 15 minutes. If you're gonna take your almond bark and you're gonna break it in half, put it in your microwave safe bowl and we're gonna start melting it. Take a fork, you're gonna dip it in here, swirl it around until it's fully covered. I'm using the almond bark for the outside but you can also use chocolate as well. Okay, so now you're gonna to wanna to go ahead while the chocolate is still Pretty warm, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and put your sprinkles on there, or any decorations that you want. So I'll do sprinkles on these. You can do stripes. So then I'm gonna go back the other way with some lines and make them nice and festive. Very easy. And now you've made your Christmas Oreo balls. They look delicious. You can put them in the fridge until you're ready to serve them. I hope you have a very Merry Christmas.